In 2021, Formula One is expected to have a brand new rule set, one of the biggest changes in Formula One history. But there was already quite a large change back in 2014 with the advent of new hybrid technology. One of the companies that was heavily involved in that was AVL Racing, and I'm joined by Michael Ressel and Matthias Dank, who are going to tell me all about how a company such as yourselves deals with a big rules change like this. So, Matthias, if I can start with you, please. Um, how does AVL prepare for these changes? You were involved with the break by wire technology back in 2014. So what kind of processes do you have in place? We have to actually prepare long before the rule change becomes active. In 2014, uh, we wanted to have cars racing, which meant that already in 2013, people needed to do the development. But if we had to do a pre-development on the tools, on the test system side, that meant we already had to start in 2012 our development. That was actually the case. Um, with the significant rule changes of 2014, which included uh, the big hybrid, uh, new hybrid system that we're racing in Formula One today, uh, two of the major challenges were systems integration, because you had so many much more systems, just count the number of, of, of different uh, electric components and control systems, and on the other side, the implication of the brake by wire. Means for the first time um, in racing, the brake system needed to work perfectly together with the engine because of the regen braking. And uh, Michael, throwing this over to you, are there any ideas and processes that you learned from 2014 and the years preceding that that you can bring to this development in 2021? Basically, the, the way to go is you try to get as much information as possible at the very early stage, try to verify it, piece the puzzle together uh, speak to as many people you know in the business. Uh, we all have to respect this confidentiality up to the time where it's officially released. So in the missing puzzles you just try to anticipate. Uh, and it's like a development for a Formula One team. We, we have to uh, develop the missing puzzles and, and more of these puzzles just to fit once the regulations are out, to fit them because the next day our customers want to have a solution. A rules change came into play for 2019, which was biometric gloves for all drivers. Um, you guys work with governing bodies as well as teams. So how does the sort of dynamic change in that regard? So obviously this has changed from 20 years ago. Uh, and uh, nowadays we are more, whilst me personally, I traditionally would have been uh, tingling from one team to the other and, and try to gain information and, and, and try to sell our solution. Now we sit down at a very early stage with the uh, uh, role makers, with the governing bodies, and, and try to bring an industry uh, focus into it, what's possible. Uh, sometimes we are allowed to help, sometimes they have their own ideas.